coal, place it in the grass, cover it up. There you have it. And the cool thing is, you still have the fungus. And this sucker will smolder for hours and hours and hours. So guys, that's a good way to start fire with the horse's hoof fungus. There is more ways of processing it down that would make it even easier, but that's one way to do it. And this thing, I'm gonna carry this out with me and it'll probably still be smoldering by the time I get back to my car. And that's like an hour hike. So it's a good way to transport fire. Just blow on it every once in a while. I've seen people, they'll take their knife and drill a hole through the thing. And then just get a willow shoot put through here and you can just kind of walk and carry it and it'll just keep smoldering. So I'm gonna go grab a willow shoot. Here's what we're looking for, just a nice small little piece of willow. We'll go ahead and just cut that off. So, once you get your willow shoot, just kind of soften it up a little bit by twisting it. Try to make it a little bit more flexible. Same way you do with withies. We're just going to do that so we can make it easier to transport this sucker. Stick your willow shoot through the hole. And then we're just going to tie it into a granny knot. Just about like that, that's all we really need. We could go ahead and double knot it, but I'm not going to bother. I'm just going to go ahead and cut off the excess. And there you go. A nice way to transport fire. Whenever you get back to another location, way out. But that is an awesome way to transport fire. You could definitely blow that into flame. <laughs> 